Hello everybody, back here again for our vlog a day, and today is Thursday the 12th, and today was a lovely, hot, beautiful day. A little bit of overcast here and there, wasn't too bad, but got up this morning uh, fairly early, got around to care the dogs, the cat, the rabbit, the whole nine yards, all the menagerie of animals that I have at the house, and then decided to go out and get my bike ride in before it got too ungodly hot, and load the bike up in the truck and headed over towards... Um, I guess Monroe Lake, Lake Monroe, and ride the trails there. I forgot how I actually rode the whole trail and did not realize I'd rode that because I'd forget where I ride sometimes. So I dropped off there at 4.15, headed out um, east, ran to the end of that, and it's like two and a half miles to the end of that part of the trail, which I was not um, real happy about. I forgot who that was. So I turned around, went the other way, went over to um, Green Springs, went over to Gemini Springs, and that um, beautiful ride, lots of shade, which I was a big fan of. Um, had a good time with it. It's a fairly decent ride. There's a little bit of, um, I guess not hills per se, but slope. I guess there's some grade. So on one way, you'll be running about three to four mile an hour faster than the other way on average just because of the up and down the slope. If you add in a little bit, say even 2% slope, and then they'll be going back, you have a negative 2% slope, it offsets a lot of your climbing. So worked out real well though. I got my ride in, talked to a couple people here and there, talked to a guy on a Tadpole, which I'm really thinking I want to buy myself is a Tadpole bike, I just haven't done it yet. Um, saw a little alligator at Green Springs, which everybody says, oh, there's no gators in the springs, the water's too cold, yada, yada not the case it clearly was right there the log lane in the spring so it happens just a little guy maybe i don't know 24 inches long not very big so had a good time there uh got back from my ride it pretty much eventless and nothing happened i did a bunch of out and back out and backs because it's nowhere near enough to get my 47 plus miles in but had a great time uh, saw the campgrounds where we camped before it's a nice little area it's not superbly great campgrounds there's not a lot to do there, but if you're into boating and fishing, it's a great one for that. And it does have access to trail. We have some hiking there. It's a beautiful little spot. But got back over home, um, chilled out here at the house a little bit. Uh, got my run in also because I want to get my run done. Um, ended up on the patio with the dogs for a while. Played some veg with them. Hung out with them for a while. Got a few other things taken care of. Just kind of general life stuff. Nothing really major. Uh, went ahead and uh, Karen got off work finally. Uh, went ahead and talked about what we can have for dinner. We had some leftover rice other days we had some soup with um, rice mixed into it so I had crackers with rice and I thought it was better than she did she wasn't as happy with it as I was but it is what it is I ended up making plans with my cousin who's down from Iowa uh, to go um, kayak tomorrow we're gonna go do Blue Springs and fairly early we're gonna get there I think our plans to be there at 7 30 kayak around a little bit then basically I got an appointment with a client at 10 30 or 11, 11 30s when the uh, women is. So I figured it was time to paddle around there, probably see some alligators, hopefully see some manatees, uh, let her have herself a little bit of fun. And then hopefully if she has time, she can fly back over here to the East Coast and then we can paddle the East Coast. Also like Mosquito Lagoon, whatever in the afternoon. So we'll see if that happens or not, but who knows. But yeah, chilled out, watched some Netflix. Um, Nothing real major, just kind of had a good time. Like I said, had a beautiful little dinner. Something super simple. I love a very simple, easy meal. Definitely makes for a lot of fun with that. So, yeah, overall, um, great day. Like I said, nothing major happened, just which I'm good with. I'm super happy, except for the ride 47 plus miles in the heat. I did end up taking my um, frozen tea with me on the bike ride, usually leaving the truck. And last time, I, my water had gotten really gross and hot on a hot day. Didn't get that hot today, but I did drink some of my tea when I stopped and like, ate my snacks and stuff. Had a little bit of tea. And then when I got back to the truck, my tea was low. So I ended up drinking hot water on the way home, which was not nearly as much fun. So I definitely didn't need to bring two bottles of frozen tea or um, deny myself drinking frozen tea on the bike ride itself. But it is what it is. So that's all I got for right now. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe, wonderful day. Thanks for watching.